it's TE side, as we've already mentioned, grouping up towards the A bomb site and Frozen, where well, he's been boosted up with Dual Berettas. Yeah, Dual Berettas. He was the highest rated player at Pro League as well. He's definitely one that we didn't touch too much on, but he comes through as the veteran for this squad now at this stage. He's in a prime position to do the damage on the contact. JDC going to take a short fight there. And now it is a wrap, so it is A that is going to be the fish. Smoke comes out to CT as they make their way through. Donut frozen with the duelist does get the first on Exa Power. And now him and JDC are looking to gain back this control because the fight is coming through from Donut. JDC tucked in behind the sight boxes. It's a little bit awkward. Clax has actually found it, but Torch is rotated over with a quick triple. Clax is now the only one left with the bomb, and there are duelies coming at him from every angle. He cannot avoid as Urshan, Urshan comes on the flash. That's a very nice nade. It gets both Ration and Finnegan. Little gap in the smoke as well by middle. Tors, you got to be careful. We'll back up. But Frozen's still here. Still holding forward. This K23, they've got control in towards mid. They're just trying to unsettle these rotations. There hasn't really been too much pressure. 30 seconds left. Dex for an exertion, expecting a B play. Here comes the utility about to drop in. It's going to completely obscure any vision that Maus would have. Exertion can just try and spray, trying to bait Dexter in with the MP9. K23 take control of the bottom site, but they need to put that bomb down on the flashbang. Perfect. Bomb cannot even be punched in. A little time as well, and the fights are just coming through. X5 has no chance. Glimpse of these players over the top of the smoke, stepping on these stones, trying to boost himself up just a little bit. K23, they've got no idea. He's here. X5 just holding the donut entrance. Finnegan now getting spammed through the smoke, not even by JDC. And he will deny that bomb plant, but that's where X5 will chime in. One for one trades. It's uh, not ideal for K23, and X5 hasn't even fired off a shot. Yeah, somehow X5 doesn't spot Dexter there, just not expecting the second player on that smoke fade. Clax could potentially get into the back lines here in Exa Power. If he gets a player that's a little too eager on the jiggle, there's potentially a way in, but 20 seconds left, no utility. Mouse are just playing this perfectly. They're sitting back. They know that bomb has to be recovered, and they need four seconds just to plant it. And there are not many seconds left on this clock. Dexter goes for the swing. He's put pace in the feed. It's an awkward duel here. Clax does find the opener onto JDC. Frozen trying to use the smoke to his advantage. He gives it one, but can't quite convert the spray. That's three openers going the way of K23. So maybe speed was the answer. They've got themselves a bomb site now, making their way through, but Torji is here. At the moment he's holding out towards long, where that bomb is going to be coming through. He's going to spot off the player across him, but can't quite hit the shot. Hits the leg on the region, but can't convert it. Pulls out the tech nine. Quite a few low players here, but he doesn't have a lot of help himself. One versus three. They know exactly where he is. Let me give this one a look in. Exa Power has his retreat, so he can't even really escape from this one. Let me see if they are going to take the fight to him, but they are being quiet at the moment. They don't need to fight him here. They know that Mao's got a lot of economy. If they want to hold on to the AWP, that's completely fine. The importance of this round right now for K23 is the round. They just want to secure it. They don't need to. It's not too bad at all this time though, Frozen trying to get aggressive and this time he wins out the gunfight, eliminates X5 and puts Rage down so low, in fact he burns. Oh, nice double from Frozen and barely a lick of damage done in response from K23. They try and repeat their success of the round prior, but it doesn't quite work out for them. Ancient can be very much determined by that fight in mid if the T's do decide to contest it. It's a very chaotic initial engagement this time mouths are the ones that come out ahead session not going for those open jiggles this time around and ooh, exa power it's an off angle being held by frozen in towards the red house so exa power doesn't spot him as he starts to clear frozen's just holding if anyone walks through donut has a player that's rotated over as well and he might just catch him. Exa Power just going to walk through. The gun barrel spotted. Swings out to clean up the kill. And Clax is going to look to get one in response. But he's peppered by JDC. That allows Frozen to swing out for the kill. He's on four looking for this ace. And Finnegan might just give it to him. He's looking to go into mid. Frozen is still here at the top. But Finnegan with 30 seconds left. Assessing his options. And there aren't many. Back at that ace. But again, looking to do something fast, trying to fight Exertion, who's been quite strong in towards Jaguar, and well, he's going to find that duel. 
even looking for potentially a further fight here as he drops that smoke through the HE through. Ration is walking up there. He's looking for contact and might just be given it. The flash is perfect from JDC. Torji almost gets the collateral. Oh, talk oh. about a follow up. X5 through the edge of the wall is removed, and Exapower has nothing he can do. Yeah, this is just cruise control from Mouse. They're just playing their own game. All the little cogs in the Mouse machine are whirring. <laughs> it's like a like a little mouse on the treadmill, making all the cogs yeah. whir. That's what I'm. That's the visual image that you've conjured for me. Something. Smoke is blocking the vision. What a spam, though. Perfectly calculated. Deals with the bomb planter and Ration. He's taken down low as well. Exertion's forced off because of the flames. Now the bomb goes down and we're in a 4v4 in the retake, but Exertion, he's pushing forward. Finnegan is holding this one and so is X5. Swings out the old, that flashbang is perfect. Exertion, a nice double kill. Torji, close combat, gets another one. Extra power, one versus three. Has found one kill, they're not on the bomb. Mishdok from Torji, he's looking for more. Extra power has found Exertion. It's now just Torji in the clutch. Extra power falling back down wrap, playing it patient. Bomb not being stuck. He's taking the gamble. Torji fires off a shot, but Exapower is taking his time here. Now the bomb has been tapped, and Exapower dodges the shot. He's pulled off the one versus three. What a clutch from Exapower. You can see he even walks down towards B. Gonna need a few more, though. Finnegan needs to leave a few more kills in his wake as well. Only one board for the IGL and Dexter the other IGL on 10 make that 11 doubling up as they make their way into the bomb site Torji gets one of his own Finnegan removed now exertion waiting to go for that spam once again and once again the lineup rewards him with the kill and we have a mirror of around about four rounds ago as extra power is now caught alone and he wants to save Torji gonna deny it though the leg not enough sadly Lost that one out in overtime. So don't count K23 out. They're gonna be walking into this great setup from JDC and Frozen. Frozen not even needed. Now he swings out for a kill. And okay, a couple back in response. Puts it into the two versus two. This power did catch off exertion up towards the ledge. So now it gets a little bit weird. Torji positioning back into mid. This is the make or break. He can either shut everything down. Or if he gets caught off, it's on. But no, he's gonna be the one that comes out ahead. And X5 has tucked in. So if Torchy just holds this line, X5 cannot budge. Here's a footsteps running away. This is a little bit of a window here. He can walk himself in towards Donut. Dexter has pushed a main in the meantime, but no. X5 is going to work all the way through. He can catch Torchy in the back here. Oh, this is perfect. X5 creeping through, spots him out, walks ever so closer. Do it. Oh, we could even knife him. Oh, yeah. Go on. Sweet justice. Aww. Not quite. Should have gone for it. Well, if you can get the bomb plant and have an AWP in the post plant with 10 HP, that is the weapon you want. Dexter is coming through and X5 is holding the angle. Dexter about to peek, but Dexter wide swings him. Oi, oi, oi. Clax up close and personal with a couple of these mouse players. Uh, he's going to get overrun, but not before he does a lot of damage on towards a couple of these players. That means X-Power can now try and step in, but gets blinded. Good damage on towards Dex, but it's still the player that has been brought low this entire time. X-5 denies the bomb. That's a really good kill to find. JDC will step in, and now Maus is trying to recover this situation. Oh, nice PG-50 kills from Frozen. Make it a three. Oh, no. He looks away at the wrong time. Oh, no. X-Power. That is not the mistake you want to be making. It looked like K23 were about to have an unlikely victory, but at the worst possible moment, his head turns around and now the bomb's been planted. Clax and X5 have to try and recover this. And X5, he's got a Galil, but he's such... Oh, dearie me, such low HP. That's really caught me off guard, no kit. <laughs> oh, that's the power. JDC loses that duel. Frozen found that kill on Rajin, but they're still committing to the A bomb site. Frozen needs to get a Mosey on if he wants to catch up with his teammates, but maybe he's not needed. Torchy finds X5. Dexter trying to hold back long, but X power with a nice shot with the scout. Now Torchy, he immediately falls back. He's got to wait for Frozen. It all hinges on his arrival. Yeah, but X power does this back drop it. I feel like if Torchy just sits back here. And just kind of full silent. K23 would have some doubt in their minds because of Frozen getting that kill. Almost would feel like 
Dorji would have rotated away, but no, instead, oversteps the mark. X power on the scout. Trying to keep K23 alive, and he's even holding Donut right now. Yeah, it looks like the right read for now, because you've got Torchy with the bomb all the way back over. You've got JDC making his way here, and they're dropping more utility. Take a look at what Mal's have to work with. They've got two smokes, so they can smoke off short and long. They've got Molotovs for these close little nooks and crannies, and it looks like it potentially could be a burst. X power. Spots the shoulder. That's a great kill to find onto JDC. Can even just keep hold of the line here. So the numbers are dwindling even further for Maus as they try and make it work up towards B. But Exa Power keeps hitting every single shot. Alright, Frozen, what have you got? Not a lot. Ration deals with him and Torchy can't do anything. Once again, we're watching. As I say that, Ration is going to start to move over to reinforce B. Good to see Ragin step it up as well because he's that player that K23 normally have that crack open the opportunities. He's really good for finding the openers. In this one, though, it's going to have to be Maus trying to find opportunity through towards Donut. There's a deep crossfire here. X5 trying to get first and Clax. He can now step in as well. There will be a trade. The Clax is here. Drops the bomb as well. Exertion was just trying to be the fly in the ointment, flanking in towards mid, but he's now the last player standing. Should be an eighth round on the board for K23. Looks pretty good. Three versus four. Dexter could be caught off guard here. Finnegan's not really looking for him, though. And as he spins round on the swivel, oh, Finnegan does catch him off guard. So this one's on. Has to be on. That point on the line. Torji, though, is going to deal with Finnegan. Extra power has to come through the same angle. So Torji can just sit here and extra power gets the better of him. 2v2 in the retake. Extra power. He's the one with all the health points. He's the one pushing forward. But Exertion's got this filthy off angle. So hard to clear this, particularly with the AWP. Nice HE hey, doesn't quite finish the job, but gives him a bit of smoke and mirrors to work with, and the nose go comes through. JDC, one versus two, but look at the clock, there's no time. Oh, they found him though. A kit is there, and the defuse comes through. Hey, Kalax holding the line, he's fully blind, and now X5 is looking to step in at CT. The rest of the troops come over. This is going to be a well fortified retake. They're really here. Up close and personal, flash through. X5 finds the shot, but that bomb has been put down in the meantime. JDC from Donut and Raging is trying to contest with this, but Exertion is holding for this exact eventuality. There's even Dexter on the flank in case Raging finds Exertion. JDC steps in, so Dexter not even needed. Three versus three, and maybe this is the time, especially with this push in from mid. Yeah, Dexter's about to pull the killing blow. They have to make their way through. Look at the clock, Dexter. Here we go. He activates, removes Dexter power, looking for more. Two on this flank. Clax is the only one left, and no time to do it. Torji finds him. Mouse, it's an absolute slog to get it done. They close out Ancient 16 10.